One Thought Up and Gems, the Urban Format Leader, Windows Media, iTunes, number one for the top in R&D. This is DJ Desires, and I am here with such a special person. This is Phoenix from Camishai Exclusive. What's going on, Phoenix? Not much. Same old, same old. You know how we do. We have this contest going on for the month of March. Tell us a little bit about the contest. Well, as you know, I'm the CEO of Camera Shy Exclusive, um, home based in Ohio, Cleveland, OH10 Stand Up. Um, and we are not your typical model agency. And we've had relatively good success since 2006. Um, steady climbing, steady doing great projects. My models have had my back all this time. But truthfully, I got homesick. I'm, my family, yeah, I'm Tennessee, Chattanooga, what's happening? And um, I took it back down south, basically. I had a good friend of mine that um, I ran into actually via the internet because um, I started off as a full figure model. And she was in the same bracket. Her name is Yana Gaines, YG, stand up. I got into touch with her and um, told her that I was thinking about branching out. And since Camera Shy is not your typical modeling agency, actually we're not a modeling agency at all, we decided to do our casting a little different. Um, I'm a firm believer in team player, team-like atmosphere, so what we did was we had a draft. We searched the internet and different outlets to see what kind of models that we wanted, what kind of hostesses we wanted, who was on top of their game, who had potential and just needed a little polishing up, and we cast the net. And what we caught was pretty good, and thus Camera Shot Texas was born. I see some of the models that you guys have picked and that were on the pick to be voted for. And I mean, I can say honestly, you guys do a great job finding the best people out there, the best people possible. Well, I thank you very much. Um, what we did originally is we had the draft, we did pick a team, and then once we had the team picked, we had an additional contest within the contest called the number one draft pick. And that was voted on by the public, camera shots, fans, associates, partners, networking community, their friends and family. And we actually had a vote for the number one draft pick because the people that actually won the draft, of course, they got their incentives for joining the company as our thank you when our token of good faith and letting them know that we definitely appreciate having them being a part of our team. But the person that won number one draft pick, they got a little bit extra, and actually today is the first time they're going to find out who won and what they got. And I know everybody's excited. I know a lot of people are, have been waiting, you know, patiently, you know, for this month to find out who won. But before we can even get into all that, we're going to go listen to some music, and then we're definitely going to come and get to know a little bit more about Camera Shy. But I, is there a song you want to hear, you know, while we're waiting? Yes, actually, like I said, Cleveland is my home away from home, so if I could really, really, really get that black cast for all I do is swag, you'd be like number one on my list of top DJs, not that you already are. <laughs> well, I got that for you. So this is my daughter from Jams again, DJ Desires. I'm here with Miss Phoenix, CEO of Camera Side Exclusive, and we'll be right back. Stack Street, put Stack Street, put Stack Street. Gucci belt and Levi's second hot Headed on the track, I'm 
Spitting fire like a dragon, yeah I'm fresh a room, I just stressing It's FW Junior Nah, now let me brush off my pumas uh, I'm flawless, I can get it in the first take Boy, I'm icy like a mother Cupcake, I make a killing And getting chips like cheese pillin' If you getting money, then you know the feeling Before I die, I'ma get a million Kid, I'm at the Bill Gates for a billion You can say that I'm bad Desires, Miss Phoenix, Camel Shot Exclusive, One Dot FM Jams. This is the official, official, official announcement of the Camel Shy Exclusive Number One Draft Pick winner. And, and uh, how you doing, Phoenix? How you doing over there? I'm good. I'm in the building. I'm actually. This isn't just. Maybe you don't know. This is not just the official announcement of the draft pick members in the number one draft. This is actually the first exclusive interview I have ever done. So big up to DJ Desire. Well, this is right. your official interview, and this is like your first good, your first good interview. How about you tell us about yourself? Like, what made you decide to get into modeling? Actually, I got into modeling on accident. As I said, I come from a Southern family, and there are some things that just are. You will learn how to be a lady. You will either learn to be a debutante, even if you don't participate. You will learn your manners. There's certain things you're just going to do. It's just the rule, <laughs> and well, there was no getting around it. But since I have been transplanted to Cleveland, the normal avenues for me to get that kind of training within the family weren't there because it was just myself and my grandparents that were here. So... Um, I actually, at 12 years old, my mother signed me up for comportment school. I mean, new attitude, Lee Rowe, if she's still in business, big up to her. I was there, and I was learning, you know, my place settings, where to put my forks, how to sit, how to walk, what to say, small uh, beauty tips as far as how to get myself my own manicure, facial, things like that. Now, I'm 12 years old, wow. and I'm learning this with um, my sister at the time. We were there, and my mom and dad sometimes would be late coming to pick us up because, you know, that was their time to hang out and be together and that sort of thing because it was on the weekend. So when they would be running late, Tommy, she also had a modeling class that she taught. She was um, a really, really, she was really at the forefront of 
um, African American women actually modeling in our community. And she she had a modeling course that she taught. And when we were done with the comportment classes, we could go hang out and watch her teach runway modeling and posing and things like that. Well, one day when she was teaching, I was in the mirror behind them mimicking what she was doing. And I was playing. But she decided I was a natural. Basically, the rest is history. So I've been doing this since 12 years old. I am short for all of you that know. So I didn't really get a lot of runway success, that kind of thing. Um, I did a lot of print work, advertisements, that kind of stuff. Um, I left the game at about 19, I want to say 18, 19. Went to college, came back right at the time Queen Latifah was coming on the scene. Beautiful full figured model. What was that? House of Darion came out. Baby Fat came out. They had a plus size line and a petite line, which was right up my alley. So I um, I did a test shoot just to see if I still had good, and I got a very very positive reception. And I've been back in the game ever since. Now I've kind of stepped behind the scenes because with all the people that I knew in the business, I was noticing that there was a need for what I call real people models, not sure right. cookie cutter. You know, tight, everybody looks the same, same height, slender, same build. Matter of fact, DJ Desires, we ran into each other when I compete, when I was first coming back, competing for a calendar spot, and I got it. (laughs) So, um, I I would deal with people that would come to me and say, hey, I'm having this event, you got any model friends that would like to come and help us host this, and this, that, and the third, and I was getting this feedback, getting this feedback. I ran into another young lady in the business, Miss Cream of the Crop, T T C E O, and we did a mixer. Um, it was basically a portfolio builder called Stilettos and Silhouettes in 2006, and that's where Camera Shy was born. Wow. See, now that's, see, that's a good history for people to see. You know, just you're evolving from being, you know, a model to actually being in charge of the models and that's a really good thing to see well and then too i i kind of wanted to break your usual mode of an agency this isn't an agency it's not hey come here read this script let me take a face shot of you and send you on your way i like to provide them with opportunities that actually beat up their resume and i'm lucky enough to have made enough acquaintances in the game to where business pretty much comes to us you know, um, for instance, my Camera Shine Ohio team, myself, the song you just heard, Black Casper, up and, cap- up and coming lyricist from Cleveland, 216. He participated as my special guest. Then there was my squad from Camera Shine Ohio, and we did the urban couple shoot. Some people paid to participate who wasn't, who weren't a part of Camera Shine exclusive. We did a charity donation, and then the rest, of course, went back into the company. Myself, Anthony George, a.k.a. Tony, George Williams, a.k.a. Geo, and Hip, a.k.a. Tiffany, all camera shot exclusive. And as I said, my special guest, Black Casper, some of our images got picked to run as the featured media alongside the Love and Relationships articles in a new magazine coming out called Atlas Voice here in Cleveland. So I'm really proud of them. They've worked their butt off. Matter of fact, Geo and Hip were in 95 degree weather at the zoo taking that shoe so they were hot it was to me horrible and they did darn thing and I, I got it in and Black Casper was a trooper he really you know what I'm saying showed up and showed out to make sure my pictures turned out well so we've been successful which of course again leads me to branching out a little bit and you guys are really it really sounds like you guys are really starting to make a buzz around the Midwest and now you have Texas so, you know, you're going to build that buzz around the south. So we're going to go and get to back to music, and then we're going to come back, and we're going to find out who the official winner is. Like, that's, everybody wants to know. Everybody is, I can hear a few people on pins and needles, because they want to know who's <laughs> <laughs> So we're going to go get to music, and we're going to come back. Okay, well, since we're talking about the south, can I get some southern music? Can I get that 180 to show that Mississippi Queen all I know? Can I hear that? Of course. And we're gonna be back. DJ Desire, Phoenix, one thousand years. Let's go. The show is starting. Along with that girl, Mississippi Queen, you all know she's the queen of freestyle. Y'all were ready for this right here. Money, 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 money,
Oh uh-huh. 